The Iowa City City Council is moving forward tonight with a potential plan to create a white water recreation park on the Iowa River just below the Burlington Street Dam. Fox 28 News reporter Brittany Borgie was at the meeting and joins us now with why the plan is making some waves. Brittany. Yeah, Scott and Tiffany, basically the plan takes a very underutilized part of the city and turns it into something that could potentially be very fun. It might or might not be a whitewater park, but city planners say they hope that it could be the anchor for the entire Riverfront Crossings project. We need to think of a good name for that park. People have been tossed around Sewer Park, and that just doesn't sound <laughs> An unsavory name for a good location. This fall, the city will demolish the old wastewater treatment plant along the Iowa River, and the hope is a park with a different name will take its place. We want to have this park be a catalyst for development around the park. The area will be the new Riverfront Crossings District. There is already a lot of interest from developers for the area to build neighborhoods there, so the city wants to make sure it gets planned well. The potential Whitewater Park would be a cut-in area attached to the river, a concern for some council members. I'm concerned about um, asking for money for future planning of what sounds like a lot of fun, but may not be able to be funded because it's not part of the flood plain. But planners say the idea is to have the park act as a floodable buffer between the river and development. So I think it will still be available for all those kinds of grants that, that deal with green infrastructure, uh, flood, flood resiliency, sustainability. The hope is to make this a safe, environmentally friendly place, Whitewater Park or not. So officially, council gave the go-ahead for city planners to move forward with the McLaughlin Whitewater Design Group to come up with an idea for the park. They'll present two potential ideas. One includes a whitewater component and one does not. Both ideas will be presented to city council in September.